guys, how's it going? Uh, welcome to another vlog trip. I haven't done one of these in a while, so I figured, well, today's a good day to do one. Um, it's rainy, cold, and cloudy all at the same time today, and I hate, I hate winter weather. I hate winter with passion. I despise it. I think it needs to fuck off. But that being said, um, I'm on my way to Evansville today. I haven't been out of my house since Thanksgiving weekend, really. Um, I, I don't like Black Friday. I didn't go, so I figured the horde has probably died down uh, in, in Evansville today, so we're gonna check out what we got there. I'm in this mood today, and I've been in it lately for the past few days, where I wanna talk about nothing but Star Wars. I don't know why, I mean, I love Star Wars, but I get on these kicks where I'm obsessed with one thing for a little bit, and then I move on to the next thing. Like, for a while it was Power Rangers, which don't get me wrong, I still like Power Rangers, but now it's, now it's Star Wars, and I want to go buy Star Wars toys for some reason. I don't, I don't know why, but I think it's probably because of the movie that's coming out. And plus, I just did this video last night talking about the new uh, Force Awakens movie. I did like a discussion on it and my thoughts, so yeah, go check that out. Right now, go watch it. Actually, I think today I'm going to go to the mall first. So when I did, get off my ass. Bitch to be tripping out here. Um, <laughs> anyways, when we get to the mall, I will get y'all back up. Um, then we're gonna go to Toys R Us. And then, ooh, took that turn too fast. Almost Tokyo drifted down the interstate. Uh, <laughs> I'm okay, I'll just talk to you guys here in a bit. See ya. Okay, so I just got to the mall. I can tell it's gonna be horrible inside because it's already busy here. Like, I had to find a parking spot way out in the middle of nowhere and it's raining that means I have to walk extra long in the rain and get drenched before I even get inside and I don't like that um also speaking of that spe there are rules to follow when you go into the mall okay and I'm gonna tell you what they are there's one side that you're supposed to walk on that you're going one way and then the other side is supposed to be for coming the opposite way people don't follow that it's it's like following the rules of the road you know what I mean like you're going one way, and somebody that's going the opposite way is on the same side. Get on the other side and walk that way, okay? Like, don't fuck up the ro the routine of the mall goers. Um, and I also don't like going into stores where people are younger than me that work there. I don't know why. I just don't like that. Like, I like to shop in, like, Old Navy and American Eagle and stores like that. And every time I go in American Eagle, like, I can't look at anything without somebody come up and bother me. Like, hey, uh... Need some help with that? Do I fucking look like I need help with that? Take your One Direction looking ass and go somewhere else, okay? If I need you, if I need you, then I will come to you. And I hate that. Like, every time I pick up a shirt or a pair of pants, they're like right there. Like, it's like they just, poof, magically appear right in front of me. Like, I'll pick up a shirt, but hey, you, uh, need some help with that? No! Get the hell away! <laughs> Anyways, same with Journeys. I don't know, does anybody shop at Journeys? I try to, usually I like to do my shopping online for clothes, but it's a little different because I like to actually look at it before I buy it, like hold it, and make sure it's going to fit. Like when I buy shoes, I'm the pickiest person, and I, and I generally like to go to Journeys to buy shoes, but I can't go in, like, I'll walk past the store, but I'm not, I, like, I haven't even gone inside the store yet, I'll walk past it, need some help trying anything on? Bitch, I'm not even in the store yet! And that's how it is when you're inside the store. Like. You go in or like, you need help finding anything? No, I'm fine. Okay, let me know if you do. And I'm like, oh, okay. And then I go to look at the shoe. You want to try that shoe on? Did I say I wanted to try that shoe on? And I hate that. Like, leave me the fuck alone. I hate going into stores and people are on my ass all the time. Need some help with that? Need some help with that? Need some help with that? Anything I can do to make your shopping experience better? I'm not buying a goddamn car. Get to stepping. <laughs> um... I'm in a good mood today. Other than the fact that my back is killing me and it's hard to walk, um, I'm in a pretty good mood. So uh, I'm going to go inside. I don't really want to take my camera inside the mall because people are going to think I'm some kind of pedophile and I'll have some asshole. Are you filming my girlfriend? No. <laughs> no. So my good mood was ruined when I got into the mall. Like, fucking jacket's in the way. Like, you know how when you're walking in the mall, and like there's people in front of you and they either walk really slow or they stop and then you try to like dodge around them and there's like no possible way so then it you have to just walk right next to them or walk with them so it looks like you're 
you're with them in their group and then they kind of look at you and, well god damn it get out of the way or walk faster i hate i don't like people that walk slow in the mall like i don't know it just bugs the shit out of me aside from that another thing that i don't like about the holidays and winter in general is that it gets dark too quickly like i got here it was it was a little after two and then now it's like almost four o'clock and it's almost dark outside like look behind me well you can't really tell because obviously it's still daylight but it's getting darker um, I didn't really see anything in there that I wanted because the horde from Black Friday, they ruffled through everything so it was a complete mess in every single store. And that's another thing. If you're going to look at something, at least put it back the way you found it. Don't just like shove it back into the shelf. Um, they were out of like all of my jean sizes. So I went into Old Navy and I bought a shirt. Like, it was a nice shirt. It's like a sweater shirt. But that was about all I found in there that I really liked. Aside from all the fucking hipster tool bags. Hey there guys, how's it going? So I just got out of... Fucking jackets in the way again. So I just got out of Toys R Us and um, they didn't have shit. Like, I got some, I got something that was kind of cool, I guess. But like, the horde from Black Friday went through everything again. And stuff was out of order. Like, the thing that I bought, I didn't know how much it was until I got up to the register. And it wasn't that expensive. Um, but yeah, everything was... was ruffled through and I don't like that so I'm gonna show you what I bought here's what I got I got this lightsaber room light and I'm guessing that you just like from what I got from the box you, you build it and it mounts to your wall so that's pretty awesome and that way if I get scared of the dark at night I can turn it on and the presence of Darth Vader will keep me safe okay that was awkward um, but yeah, I'm pretty, I, I'm seriously going to hang this up in my room somewhere, um, if not my spare bedroom. So I'm pretty, pretty stoked about it. I get to build it. Like, I'm going to feel like a fucking Jedi when I build this thing. And uh, yeah, <laughs> I'm going to stop. But now we're going to go to, we're going to go to Starbucks. And I'm pretty excited because before too long, they're going to stop making their pumpkin spice frappuccinos. So I guess it's only a fall item is what they say. So I'm going to go there and then we're going to head home. I don't really even want to go to coconuts anymore because I know they're not going to have anything that I want. So uh, when I get to Starbucks, I'll, I'll be back. What's up? Okay, so I'm in the line for Starbucks. See how much darker it's already getting? Like I have to have all my lights on in here. It's already getting dark. And, uh, and there's people looking. Anyways, there's always this... There's this guy that works here at Starbucks, and I call him Creepy Starbucks Guy because every time, and it never fails, every time that I'm here, the same dude takes my order, and he's so creepy, but he's so nice at the same time. And every time I pull up to the window, it, it could be daytime, nighttime, any time of the day, it never fails, he's always the one that takes my order. And he's always like, hello there, what can we get started for you? I'm like, um, okay. Because one time I was here, and we had to sit in line for like 35 minutes at least, and we got to the window, he handed us our order, what we had ordered, and he was like, here's your two mocha frappuccinos and your caramel frappuccino. And I was like, I didn't order a caramel frappuccino. He's like, I know. And gave me that creepy ass smile. I didn't drink it, I immediately threw it away because there were probably hallucinogens in it and some sort of tape rape drug. So I threw it out immediately. And this fucking line is so long. It's always like this now. Lately, I've been coming here and the line's super long. I think it's because the horde from Black Friday hasn't fully dispersed yet, so they're still scavenging, I guess. I don't know. Hi, do you still have your pumpkin spice? Uh, yeah. Ooh, okay, can I get a... <laughs> oh, yes. Can I get a venti pumpkin spice, well, a pumpkin spice frappuccino? Yeah. Okay, sure. Do you want a piece of our delicious pumpkin bread and have a snowman cookie to go with that today? Yeah, that sounds good. Oh, come on. All right, if you change your mind, just let us know the window. Yeah, yeah, I, the pumpkin the pumpkin bread. Really? Oh, I'm so, I'm so excited. Okay, is that all for you? <laughs> yeah, that's it. All right. It's going to be eight the window. All right, thank you. It wasn't creepy Starbucks, guy. So... That's a first. <laughs> I'm kind of embarrassed. Like, I just told you that big long story about how some creepy ass dude always takes my order and then you guys didn't get to witness it with me. But I guarantee you, if not, he will be in there working. Because he's like, I don't think he does anything else but 
eat, sleep, and breathe Starbucks. So, this line needs to hurry up. Hey guys, how's it going? So, okay, I'm back in my house. I'm back home from Evansville. Today was kind of a bust, I think. Um, the horde, as I like to call it, the Black Friday shoppers, that's what we're going to call Black Friday shoppers, or a busy crowd in general. The horde ransacked through everything and every store that I wanted to go to, so I didn't really find anything. Um, kind of bummed about that. Um, I actually had a good time chilling with y'all today, <laughs> so, uh, I'm going to put this lightsaber thing together that I bought, and I got some Applebee's in there that I'm about to go eat, so I'm pretty pumped for that. Um, haven't been there in a while, actually. It's been... About three weeks now, so I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna get this video put up or edited and then put up for you all to view it. And uh, actually, by the way, why don't you go ahead and follow me on Instagram? Uh, yeah, go ahead and, and uh, do that right now. I'm gonna put the link to my Instagram account in the description below. Go ahead and like me on Facebook or follow me on Facebook, whichever you prefer to do. Um, I actually have a Facebook page just for my own channel. So yeah, I'll just put all that down there. Go ahead and do that. You will instantaneously feel better about life in general once you do that. Um, I think that's going to wrap it up. Um, yeah, that's definitely it now. Okay, see ya.